Try not to assume Moaz is coming next week, as that might just be exactly what they want apes to think. I'm as excited as all of y'all for the Moaz, but I always try to expect the worst. In this case, Moaz not coming for a long time yet. If you gear yourself up for the Moaz this week, you could be disappointed, of course. It's important to keep the hype up and keep the faith alive, but if I was a hedgie, I'd be thinking the perfect time to tank it further would be when everyone is expecting an imminent Moaz. I'm expecting a red week this week and hope to lower my average cost, but Moes is coming, we just don't know when. Stay strong, apes. Next up to the moon and beyond, check out this article from LinkedIn. It says this level of failure to deliver accumulation is criminal and could very much cause systemic risk to a world financial system. If the blue chip long positions like Tesla, Apple, and Amazon that are held by these funds are liquidated to pay off their margin calls or for the NSCC buybacks, the market itself could see a catastrophic event. And Griffin casually evaded questions directly asked by Andreessen regarding the company's short position in GameStop and AMC theaters. When this short squeeze happens, it could result in the greatest transfer of wealth in the market history and liquidations of a number of hedge funds, valued in the trillions collectively. Guys, we could be on the brink of a historic event happening, and this is what the apes have been expecting for a long, long time. Next, I found this pretty cool post. Listen in, guys. Amazon fell from $110 to $11 before going to $3,000 per share. Bitcoin, remember, dropped from $20,000 per coin to $4,000 per coin before going to $60,000. And now many people think Bitcoin's going straight to $100K+. Plus. Tesla went from $300 to $180 before going to $2,000 per share. The trick isn't picking the right investment. The trick is holding on to the right investment for a long time. Now, this is a really good point, a good post, and overall just a good reminder when it comes to investing all along. A lot of us are very worried about the day-to-day -day moves, whether something moves you know, up $5, down $10, everything in between. But we have to realize is that if you pick the right companies and just let time do its thing, I mean, if you look historically, at least speaking, a lot of times history has shown that if you just bet on the right stocks and sit back, watch it go up, watch it go down, watch it go up, watch it go down, over time in the long run, the outcome is going to be worth it. But if you want to stay up to date with everything else that's going on with AMC, because trust me, there's a lot more to go through, make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on a video. Also, drop a like on this video for some good luck moving forward for AMC. And lastly, go to the second link down below in my description and join my private exclusive Discord server. Thanks as always, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.